Hey guys, so it's April, obviously, and today I am going to be talking to you about the Mandela Effect. Well, specifically, this is going to be a Christmas themed edition, okay? Most of these Mandela Effects I've held myself and they've pretty much freaked me out. I've been wanting to do a Mandela Effect video for quite a while now, but the reason why I haven't done it is because I felt too many other YouTubers were doing it, so it'd be kind of pointless, do you get what I mean? But I can't find that many YouTubers who are doing Christmas themed one. I also can't find any, but couldn't find any. So I had to find most of these myself without like looking into other people's research. Made life hard. Spent a whole week researching it. So these are the best ones that I came up with, okay? These are the top five Christmas Mandela effects, okay? So the first one. As a kid, we all sung Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, didn't we? Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer had a very shiny nose And if you ever saw... Ever saw what? Some videos say, if you ever saw him, you would even say it was And others say, and if you ever saw it, you would even say it glows So is it it or him? It seems to be keep continuously change. I don't quite know if that's a Mandela effect or not. It could be. Um, my main thoughts are it, it, it was probably it. If you shot, ever saw its nose, kind of, you'd even say it glows. And then because that's how I grew up singing it. And don't know how you guys grew up singing it. Leave leave it comments below whether you say you say it or him. And you know my thoughts. They must have changed it. You know. So anyway, that's the first one. I, I, I just don't know what to sing anymore. Well, on the first day of Christmas, that, that song, okay. This is the next one, okay, number two. Um, <laughs> on the first day of Christmas, my true love gave to me I've always sung on the first day of Christmas my true love gave to me and then I used to fuck up the rest because I could never remember what they gave me in the song ever, I could never remember the lyrics, still can't um, according to the internet the f first one is a partridge in a pear tree partridge in a pear tree, which sounds accurate but um, anyway, it says my true love gave to me, that's what I always sung, that's what my friends always sung, that's what my teachers always bloody sung to us in primary school, that's what everyone always sung, but now it says my true love sent to me, sent, not gave, sent, okay, a bit weird, um, they all pretty much say sent, it's very rare you can find a video that says my true love gave to me. Um, scent doesn't sound correct to me because I've always said gave, my true love gave to me, not my true love bloody scent to me. That's a bit heartless, isn't it? It's nice, I prefer it when people give me things instead of send me things. So yeah, that's the second one. Once again, please let me know. Do you ever sing gave or do you say scent? It's, it's a bit weird. This third one is also a song, sorry. Um, Christmas is just a very musical holiday, okay? And they're, they're the ones I like listening to to try and find these things out. Anyway, I loved singing as a kid. It was one of my favourite Christmas songs slash carols, whatever. We wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas, we wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. And then it goes. Good tidings we bring to you and your, and I used to say King. I don't even know about you, King. K I N G. I'm terrible at spelling, sorry, King. I don't know whether that's because I live in England where we have like a royal family, so King makes a more fitting sense as a child. I don't know. My used to always say, Good tidings we bring to you and your King. When I found, when I research this it actually says good tidings we bring to you and your kin k-i-n kin yeah kin and um, i did look it up didn't know what a kin was apparently it's like a family member or relative which makes more sense than king but 
Officer Show, it said King, and I actually rang up Alicia, if you remember Alicia from previous old older videos, I rang her up and I said to her, I sang like most of that song to her, and said, good tidings we bring to you and your, and what's next, but stem, not belong to Alicia, and she said King, K-I-N-J, King, and so it's not just me, I sung it to Belinda, she said Kin, K-I-N, so, don't know, um, but it's actually Kin, not King, I used to be pretty sure it was King. <sighs> My childhood's over. Right, so another thing, has anyone seen an, The Nightmare Before Christmas? I think that's the name, Nightmare Before Christmas, okay. Have, has anyone ever watched that or read that, whatever? I have, I haven't personally, I was going to for this video, but I haven't. I've written this down because of course I've not heard the song, so I don't know the lyrics, but um, apparently one of the songs go. Boys and girls of every age, wouldn't you like to see something strange? Come with me and you will see this, this, our town of Hel Halloween, whatever. So it apparently says that, well that's how people remember it, but it actually goes. Boys and girls of every age, wouldn't you like to see something strange? Come with us and you will see this this our town of Halloween. So it says us in real life instead of me. And everyone remembers it saying come with me, not come with us. And even though I haven't even heard the song, come with me so makes more sense. But, you know, whatever, come with us, come with me. Come with me sounds better, but that's the wrong way to sing it. Okay, so, a bit strange. Do you guys remember it like that? Finally, we have Twas the Night Before Christmas, that little poem thing. Some people remember Twas the Night Before Christmas saying like however way through it was, the segment where people think it says, and mama in her kitchen, and I in my cap, had just settled in, had just settled our brains for a long winter's nap. Okay, but it doesn't actually say that, okay? It doesn't say settled our brains. It says, um, a mummy in a her chin, and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. So nothing to do with brains, a bit weird. But some people remember it differently. Mm. Brains sounds a bit weird though, to be honest, so you can see why they changed that one. Now then, I don't know the reason for the Mandela effects coming out, but I'll give you a few, um, a few ideas. So, some people believe that the Mandela effect um, is caused by, like, time travel, so in the far distant fu future, people have finally developed time travel and then people who own like businesses and things like that keep going back in time to when they were making things like films etc songs and changing them changing the lyrics a bit for financial gain okay or just <laughs> mess with us whatever so that's one main reason um, a more realistic reason is Probably, I haven't heard a YouTuber say this, probably because it is the less crazy idea, but I honestly just think it's probably because of the way our brain works. We probably remember things differently, and then when we haven't heard a specific like poem ourselves, like on the radio and things, we probably but just heard other people say it. it's a bit like Chinese whispers and the words get changed a bit by the time they get to us it's slightly different and that's probably why we remember it different and then even if we hear that song properly we we still have it stuck in our brains the first time we heard it when someone else said it but I don't know that's my opinion I don't know the actual reason for the Mandela effects please let me know down below what you thought to this video whether the Christmas themed ones freak you out. If you'd like more just let me know if this video can get to 20 likes by next week so in seven days then I will do another Christmas Mandela Effect video. The reason why it's 20 and I, I struggle to get to three 
three likes on my videos but the reason why I'm saying 20 is because it's very hard to figure out it's it's very hard to find Christmas Mandela effects because there essentially is none um, so I have to figure them out myself watch ev listen to every single carol etc etc um, so yeah please like the video if you haven't already um, subscribe if you're new subscribe and it mean the world to me let me know down in the comment section if you'd like me to do more conspiracy theories more Mandela effect videos you know I could do one for New Year I don't know just comment below what kind of videos you'd like me to do if you haven't already subscribed subscribe is important to me it makes me want to make more videos all the time thank you for watching guys bye